You are what makes Sanctuary great, and it is my pleasure to welcome you as Sanctuary's newest member. Throughout your membership, I have no doubt that you will learn and make some amazing things. But before you do, you need to know a few things, and the first is safety. We take safety seriously around here because there are simply tools in the shops that can take off your finger and seriously injure you. Always read the provided safety literature for every tool before using it. Never use a tool for the first time by yourself and always wear PPE, personal protective equipment, when using any tool. In the case of an evacuation, there are two exits, one to the front of the building towards Governor's Drive and one towards the back through the stairwell to 8th Street. In the case of a weather emergency, the women's restroom is our facility shelter. Make sure the door is completely closed and that you are sheltering in place. Make sure to stay there until the threat has completely passed. Now that we have all that covered, let's talk about getting you into the building for the very first time. The entry doors are outfitted with coded locks. The door code that you provided with us when you subscribe to become a member will allow you to get into the building. First, as you approach the door, you will notice there is a large black area above the handle. You can simply press your hand against this blank area or press a finger up against the finger code reader. Once you do that, the number pad should appear. At this point, you put in your four to six digit code that you gave us. After putting in your four to six digit code, press the bottom enter button. Once you do this, the door should have a message on the front of it that reads, the door is now open. Simply turn the handle and open the door. If your code does not work for any reason or the door does not open easily, please contact me, Kenny, at SanctuaryHSV.com. Several of our shops use this same coded doorknob method. If your shop does not use that method, either the machine will have a code on it, for instance, in our media and design computer lab, your password to the computers is your door code. For some shops, you may have to log in using your mobile device or computer to turn on the power tools. Only if you are subscribed to that shop will you have access to those power tools. Congratulations, you're in the shop for the first time and ready to start working. To learn more, check out the video specifically for your first shop. And if you ever have any questions, comments, or concerns, feel free to message me directly at kenny at sanctuaryhsv.com. I look forward to seeing what you make.